into it for foundation I'm using this Clinique Beyond Perfecting this has a much longer name but I'm gonna skip that I'm using the giant applicator to paint it on all over my face and again I am rushing Christmas time is so demanding I promise I swear today is my day off I'm gonna film all of the videos literally all of them using my white-ish beauty blender to blend and bounce all of that foundation out <laughs> Mid bouncing, I realized my lights weren't on, but double thumbs up, I fixed it. For concealer, I'm using the Kat Von D Locket Concealer in the shade Light 3. I was obsessed with this for a long time, but I think it's starting to dry out, or maybe I'm just really low, because lately it seems really thick and hard to blend out. So I'm adding Urban Decay Weightless Concealer in Fair. This is like my go-to SOS concealer. This is the one that I mix with a concealer that needs help. Using that same beauty blender to blend it together, it makes a full coverage duo. Side note, I really considered naming this. My cat does my voiceover. I am so curious to see with the power of the clickbait title. I'm setting that concealer with the Laura Mercier powder. I really want to do the dad does my voiceover thing because it would just be him telling me how much makeup I wear. I think he would refuse to do it. <laughs> but because he would probably refuse to do that, I'm really considering having my sister's boyfriend do it because he's really funny and he does that perfect girl voice. <laughs> you know where he sounds more girly than the girls? Anyways, I'm baking my chin, beardy area, and then I'm going to brush that bake off and up and that's how I'm setting my contour area. bronze. I'm using this cargo bronzer. It has some shimmer in it. This hat is making my fat face look fatter, so I'm heavily bronzing today. This hat, by the way, was a Christmas present from my sister. My sweet sister watches all of my videos and I love her so much. Shout out, sister. I love you and I love my hat. I hit up the nose with the bronzer more than I usually ever do, but I really like the way it turned out. To highlight, I'm using Nectar from the Sweet Peach palette. This is a beautiful highlight. And I'm finally able to smell this palette actually. <laughs> I've heard so many people say that this smell makes them feel sick. You are sick, like in the head. <laughs> it smells so good. I literally got eyeshadow on my nose from smelling so hard. I'm setting it all with the Urban Decay All Nighter and then coming back for the eyes. Starting off with this never ending Tarte Shape Tape. Glitter Killer, this tutorial is for you. I hope I have pleased you. She asked for a grungy look using this palette. If you think you have seen this look from me before, <laughs> you have. <laughs> Setting my concealer with peaches and cream, and then I'm gonna mix puree and summer yum, and I'm putting that into my crease and above, and I'm building it up very slowly. I'm sorry that this is kind of a boring look, but I love warm, smoky everything. I'm taking Summer Yum onto this fluffy packing brush and I'm more patting this on and then blending. I found that this is the method you can use to get a much better payoff from the pigment. And I'm also smoking out that lower lash line and then continuing to blend. For lips, I'm using this Kylie Mini in Ginger, which is a literal exact match for Leo from Jeffree Star. Tomorrow's video will be more interesting than this one, I promise. I don't even know what it's gonna be, but I promise. <laughs> Thank you guys so much.